أعوذ بالله من الشيطان الرجيم بسم الله الرحمن الرحيم الحمد لله والصلاة والسلام على رسول الله وعلى آله وصحبه ومن تبعه وله وسلم تسليما كثيرا. I want to share a small thing with you. Close to my house, every time I drive, يعني going back to my house, there is a fancy luxury car dealer. Luxury car dealer. I don't want to say the brand to make marketing or anything like that. But it is a nice car. It's like uh, above 100,000, you know. So I can't resist every single time I go, I can't resist the idea imagining myself driving one of those. Wouldn't you? No? No? You just drive by dealer and say, Alhamdulillah, I'm, I'm satisfied. <laughs> right? Everybody, mashallah, everybody is satisfied, good. You know, drive by the fancy car. No, no, no. I'm, I'm good with my Camry and uh, Accord, you know. Yeah? I don't think so. Oh, come on, يعني, right? We pass by these dealers and we imagine ourselves. At least imagine. It's not haram to imagine, right? And then reality hits and it brings you back again. Then you're good, right? <laughs> yeah. You drive in a very nice neighborhood and you find big luxury houses. Or you visit, mashallah, one of the brothers of the community that Allah blessed them with big houses. May Allah protect, say ameen. And you say, subhanallah, you know, it comes to your heart that what if this is mine? What if I have something like that? Then reality again hits once you drive out, you know, and you go and you see your invoice in the bank, I mean statement in the bank, and then you say, Alhamdulillah, I'm good, right? Why we don't do that with the Quran? Huh? Why we don't do that with the Quran? When you see different qiraat of the Quran coming, you are satisfied. You know, I like Surah An-Nas only like that. Why Sheikh Mamdouh said, Qul Udrab bin Nis? Why he recite every day like a qira'ah like this? Just stick with what I have, you know? I learned wudu like that, and that's it. Don't confuse me, man. You know? I, I don't want to know more knowledge. No more. It's just stick to that. We don't have that ambition with the deen of Allah. We need to change that tonight, inshallah, Rabbil Alameen. Can we do that, inshallah? Always have higher, bigger, wider horizons. Imagine that Rasulullah sallallahu alayhi wa sallam every day the Sahaba is sitting there what we are going to learn new today. What, what, is, what is going to be the blessing of Allah on us today? Rasulullah sallallahu alayhi wa sallam giving us tonight something special. I want that. I want more. I want more of the deen of Allah. I want to know more. I want to hear Quran more. I want to pray more. After I go, I, I still want to prove to myself that I can read two more rakahs, and two more rakahs, and two more rakahs, and make the wit a little bit longer, and read a different surah, and memorize an additional page. Can we do that, inshallah? And when reality hits, you will actually find yourself, you did it. It is not that car, it is not that house. That, you know, reality prevents you from fulfilling your dream. With the deen of Allah, Actually, reality will help you fulfill the dream. You just need to put some effort behind it, inshallah, Rabbil Alameen. Tonight, we were reciting with the Qira'ah of Imam Abu Amr al-Basri and his narrator, Imam al-Susi, with famous with the Idgham. Yaqool lahu yastati'oon nasrahum. Whenever two letters, they are the same, doesn't matter, you know, they are haraka or sukun, he joins together. And, you know, many other things. So, alhamdulillahi, rabbil alameen, may Allah azza wa jal make us among those who serve al-Quran more and more and more. Wa salli allahumma wa sallim wa barik ala Sayyidina Muhammadin wa ala alihi wa sahbihi wa sallam. Stay ambitious, brothers, with the deen and the Quran. Faddal.